your hand. Put your arms out. Here's Adina, Adina. Put your arms out. future gymnast. Stick your arms out, Adina. Oh, gotta do it again. There she goes. <laughs> it's always turn. <laughs> My your back turn. hurts. Steal my tripod. Put your head down there and stick your arms up. Luke taking a shower. Adina, stick your arms up there. Playing his name. Oh. So, update on Judah's back. Still That's hurts. pretty red. He's in pain. So, and Jessica was really nice and went and got him some spray aloe. So, we are going to see if... <laughs> This does the trick. Okay? Let's give it a shot. Okay, Kylie. Say uncle. uncle. Say Ray. Ray? That's me. Yeah. Uncle Ray. Uncle Ray. Yes. You're the cutest. Where did no Is that is that you? Is that Kylie? Who's this girl? She's so pretty. Uh -huh. No, I think baby wants the one. Something on top, but. Is your mom gonna have another baby? Is that what you're saying? Your mom and a baby. How many babies is she gonna have? Mom have a baby or two, nine, nine. Baby or two? Two, uh, Maybe two. five more? Five more? She, she, do you want a brother or sister, another one? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Mom's not approving. <laughs> yeah. Oh, there you are. Look at that smile. I know to the picture. Yeah, take a picture. To put the bun. Whoa. So close. So look what you just do. We went to the aquatic park. The aquatic park? Yeah. Sorry, what was one of your favorite parts? Um, the pink slide. Pink slide? I know I do that. One of Adina's favorite parts. Hey, you want to tell me your favorite part, miss? Oh, you okay? Yeah, she really... I'm going to go ahead and watch this the fun day the aquatic park, Grandpa and Grandma taking us to Burger King. Oh yeah. Zoe, let me see your nose. Look how burgers you got. Oh, it's just nose, but... Kids are saying their goodbyes, just loaded the van. Oh, he's sad to go. Let's go say goodbye. You We're heading back to Arizona. Hey guys, you Hi. ready to go? No. No, back to reality. Saying. Back to school. Back to their know. friends though, so that'll be yeah, good. Yeah, and yeah. back to their own beds, in my own bed, more importantly. So, uh, awesome. love staying with Ron and Renee, Jessica. They were so gracious, so kind. Uh, they always are. And so, uh, had a lot of fun with them and the rest of the family. So, but we're looking forward to going home. Here's to another 22, four, six hours. I don't know, a lot of hours ahead. We're at Costco, I think in Roseburg. Say hey, everyone. Hi. Tell there's a lot of enthusiasm. We're about two and a half hours into our way home. So hopefully we'll be back sooner than later. So I want you to know that her nose is peeling. There it is. Boom. We'll check in a little bit later. Next stop. Everyone say goodbye to Oregon. Hi, Oregon. Everyone say hello, California. Hello, Cali. Now we start our trek through California to get to AC. It's about 1.30 in the morning. We spent about 15, 20 minutes at standstill on the freeway on I-5.
pray for our youth ministry for every young African intern graduation is nice. That's going to be really cool. Uh, we're just going to go to a different location even. So I'll show you a little bit of that. I just wanted to let you know, really, really close to making it home. Hey, so it's uh, like 7.30. We made it home. <laughs> I'm so tired. So I have uh, helped get the kids started on breakfast and they're getting a little bit more going and I'm gonna lay down for a few hours and just get some rest. So Adina's chore is setting the table and she's doing a really good job, but she did set up a few extra places. There's only six of us here right now. That's 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 napkins. <laughs> Hi cutie, good job. And one more, are you setting the table for us? Thank you. Hey, so it's 12.45 and getting some lunch for the kids and myself, trying to get back on the uh, healthy train. So I got the water and uh, got the salad going. Bread, a little bit of carbs, but it's okay, people. I've been laying pretty low on the carbs uh, lately and I'm getting some work done as well. Had an offer on uh, one of my listings. So I uh, want to make sure that we can get back to the buyers. And hopefully we can reach an agreement. Hey guys, it is Wednesday afternoon and I am headed home after a long day Ray and the kids got home this morning in fact they got home just shortly after I left for work so I am super excited to see them it's been a whole three days just about so I miss them a lot and I'm excited to get home well, I'm at home and I'm about to go see my kids for the first time since Sunday we'll see how they react They're already screaming inside. Hmm. Here we go. Yikes. I'm happy to see you. Yeah, I'm happy to see you. Now we could be a family again. Oh, you're so sweet. We have Gigi Shark cookies. You do. So the kids wanted to eat some lemon tonight. A couple of them have never had lemons. This is inspired by watching Josiah's video. I'm going to try mine. I'm going to try mine. Alright, we'll try it, so. What do you think? It's not bad. It's not bad. It's not bad. Sour, sour, sour. Josiah has full on got it in his mouth. He has yellow teeth. Do you like it still? I like that. What? I don't like it. You don't like it? I want another one. Okay, well, you don't have to eat it. Hi. I want another one. No. Are you Adina's? Can you Adina's? No, I want it. Then get used. Can you have another shot of the lemon in your shirt? Do you like yours? Do you like yours? I'm going to put the lemon juice in my hot chocolate. I do. Mama, I have to wear mine. She's just looking at her. Okay. I ate mine.
see me. They're going to watch me. They're going to look at me. And great leaders understand that the power of leadership is not just found in complaining about all the problems, but learning to be a part of the solution. Come on. Come on. That's Good. who you are. You're going to be a part of the solution from now on. And that takes you learning to be on the front row. Right. You'll never be seen at the back. But if you value your front, the front, you'll be a leader. Number three, leaders have learned to lean in every painful situation. And I can tell you that in the last few years that Kristen and I have been married and planting a church, and even in the last year, we have been through painful situations. And in every painful situation, we've learned to ask ourselves a very important question. What can I learn from this? What can I learn through my pain? thank you YouTube for being a wealth of knowledge and information and knowing how to do anything and everything thanks to you our garbage disposal is now working and we didn't have to replace it I just had to press a red button on the bottom of it and uh, I don't know right tinkered around with it too and tightened it or loosened it I don't remember but anyway it's working so that's fantastic because it was starting to get stinky and gross and anyway glad it is fixed so thank you youtube thank you well we're back reunited and it feels so good mm, it does <laughs> it's nice what'd you do while we were gone probably had nothing to do yeah you were no. lost without me i mostly worked it was busy yeah i was lost without you <laughs> but i did go to dinner with my friend leah last night that was fun we went to chili's I had mango chicken. It was really yummy. And, uh, yeah, it was fun to hang out with her for a while. Yeah, it's good times, good times. So we finally made it. It was like a 22-hour drive. Got in around 7. I yeah. uh, saw there. I was so, so tired. Slept for a few hours. Got up and had some lunch. Made lunch for the kids. Then went back and laid down for a couple more hours. And now I am done and ready for bed again. <laughs> I got home from work and the door was locked. <laughs> His, oh. The bedroom door was locked. My kids kept walking in and waking me up. So after the 19th time, I decided, you know, <laughs> probably, <them> out. <laughs> probably best to just uh, lock the door and get some <laughs> sleep. So thankfully they didn't kill each other while I was asleep. But no. <laughs> uh, it's good to be back. We'll be, uh, got a few things lined up this weekend. Going to be showing some homes of the Ruby Dews tomorrow. Hopefully we can get them under contract. They got a couple offers coming in. And then uh, Friday, we're going to do a video shoot for our small groups, collect small groups at church. So that'll be fun. Yeah, <laughs> good times, good times. Tonight, went and uh, hung out with a bunch of students for FY intern graduation. It was really, really cool. Uh, I'm a big fan of teenagers. Uh, just think that they are, maybe not when we have our own, but, <laughs> yeah, we'll but of other people's teenagers. Uh, we were youth pastors for a long time. So yeah. 
I just believe in students, and it's so cool to see just what God was doing in their hearts and in their lives and hearing a little bit from some of them. So excited about the future. Pastor Christian, Pastor Brittany are killing it. All their leaders are amazing, and uh, just they have an incredible team and, and love seeing everything that's going on. So anyway. Awesome. Hey, don't forget, like, comment, and subscribe. Hey, next Tuesday, too, just so you know, we're going to be dropping a little thing called Tuesday's Take. And so the first one's going to be from just me I'm flying solo on it. Okay. <laughs> It'll be a little bit of a rant, a little bit of a take, thoughts, ideas, things that were going on in our head and our hearts, whatever. Cool. I like it. All right. See you soon. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.